Hey, you okay? You all right? About time you woke up. I was starting to think maybe they'd fried your brains or something. You got a headache, right? Don't worry. That'll get better. I don't know if it'll matter, but it'll get better. They must really like you. At least they let me keep my clothes. Looks like they stripped you of everything. Crazy, ain't it? I thought I'd seen some shit out there in the waste, but nothing like this. Not a whole lot of good news going around right now. If you're lucky, they'll leave you alone for a while. If not, well, then it's been nice chatting with you. You've got it all wrong, kid. You're in here with me. This is my little slice of heaven, not yours. Not a good time for jokes, I guess. Look. I don't know why they put you in here with me. Maybe it's another experiment. Not like I can ask them to find out. But since you asked, name's Soma. Beyond that, I'm thinking not much matters if we're gonna stay stuck in here. Your guess is as good as mine. I can't understand what they're saying. I don't remember half of what they did to me. And that might be a good thing. I know we ain't the only ones. There's a whole bunch of us in here. They'll pluck folks out every now and then. Sometimes they bring them back, sometimes they don't. Either way, I ain't keen to find out what they're doing. I've been here for a little while, but haven't found a way to... Shit, you hear that? It's coming again. Get back against the wall now. At least it wasn't coming for us. We gotta get out of here. I'm thinking maybe now you can understand it's a good idea to get the hell out of here? What, you've never seen a giant metal claw scoop somebody up and carry them off to who knows where? I don't know where they're taking him, and I'm not interested in staying here long enough to find out. We gotta get out of here, kid, now. Okay, yeah, let's do something about getting out. Well, there ain't no easy way out, trust me, I've looked. Can't even find anything to pry open, see what's blocking the doorway. I'm thinking they did us a favor, putting us together in here like this. And I say we use it to our advantage. They're keeping an eye on us, you know. Watching us. So I say we give them a little show. Give them a reason to pay a little extra attention to us. They want us alive for something. Who knows what? Point is, if it looks like one of us is going to kill the other, they'll step in to stop it. So that's what we do. We throw a few punches, make it look real, and then jump them when they come in to break it up. It's worth a try. What's the worst that could happen? Nothing changes. Only we've got a few more bruises. Big deal. Let's give it a shot. I promise. I'll go easy on you. Oh, uh, okay. So does that mean you're in? All right, I'll hold back on you. Make sure you don't get too roughed up, okay? And you be ready. Soon as they come in to get us, you take them down. Come on, make it look good. Ow! Come on, make it look good. Yeah. Hey, kid, be careful. Ah! and let's
let's go. Who knows how long it'll be before they send more after the rest. Okay, we gotta find a way out of here. Not a clue. I'm hoping we can get some answers once we get out of this place. Can't be real. This can't be happening. I'll wake up any minute now. Just need to wake up. supposed to do with it. You have to shut that off to open the door here. Escaping? Do you want to see the rest of this place? I've seen a bunch. I can show you if you want. Great! How about you pay less attention to me and more to finding a Oh, great. Well, so much for that idea. She suckered you good, huh? See? I told you I could help. Sure. I love exploring, and it's been a while since I've been out and about. We'll have to be careful, because they'll be mad that we're out. But it's okay. I know how to get through the steamworks. We need to get to the big engine room, so I can show you the rest of the ship. Let's go. I don't have any family anymore. My mom and dad died a while ago, before I ended up here. 
You know, back when all the bombs dropped on everything. Yeah, it was right after that. And then me and my sister, we got pulled up here. Except, I haven't seen her in a long time. Oh, I've been here a while. A long while. Sometimes, I can sneak out of my cell and go explore. I've seen a bunch of the ship. It's pretty neat. But they always catch me and put me back here. Sure. We need to go to the big engine thing, and then from there we can go up to the top of the ship. That's where the guy in charge is. I've only seen him once or twice, but he's extra mean. I guess you'll probably have to kill him or something, huh? Okay, come on! I guess they're already looking for us. I can sneak past them in the vents, but you're too big to fit. We'll have to figure out how to get around. Wow, really? I get to use a grenade? Neat! Cool. Give me just a second to get behind them. I think there are more coming down the hall. Just stay here, and I'll try and get this door open for you. Hmm, maybe it's this other wire. Out. There are still a few to your right. If you can, you can the door to the left.
didn't see those two. Uh, there's a door on the left I can open, though. You should try and go that way. Sorry. Turn it off! Last time I was here, I used this to get to the top of the ship. It's kind of like an elevator, only it doesn't just go up and down. Feels sort of tingly, too. He must be pretty angry that we're exploring. Oh, I know! Come on, I know another way up! This is it. Pretty neat, huh? I never had the courage to wake them up, but I think you're going to need to. The spaceman has a suit, and we need him to use it. I've seen these all over. They put people in them, and the people go to sleep. They stay asleep for a really long time, too. Be careful if you touch them, though. They're really cold. Well, because he's got a spacesuit. Can't go out in space without one. And if we're going to escape, we need to go outside. If they turn out the elevator things, that's the only other way to go. So we need a suit. See? Simple. I don't know. I've never talked to them. 
Sometimes I'd come and look at them and wonder why they're dressed like that. You see that one guy? He has this really neat suit on, like armor or something. And that other guy? He looks just like a cowboy. I saw pictures of cowboys in books. I never saw a real one, though. This is going to be so neat!